with overactive bladder, it's a spectrum of disease. And what we want to do is offer treatment options for patients that they can live with. Okay, so we'll initially start with conservative treatment. So we'll look at what people are drinking, when they're drinking, and I'll often have people keep something called a bladder diary so that they know um, when they're going. People are sometimes very sensitive to different foods and drink, so we can eliminate those. There are actually physical therapists that are called pelvic floor physical therapists that have special training to work with both men and women to control urgency and frequency of their bladder. We can always add medication. There are seven different drugs out there that can help with overactivity. And if those things don't work, we can move on to procedural things. Uh, one of them is called PTNS, which is percutaneous tibial nerve stimulation. That's where we put a little needle in the ankle like acupuncture to help calm down the bladder. And those are treatment sessions done in the office. There's Botox for the bladder where we can actually inject the bladder with Botox. And if those things don't work, we can always add an implantable device that's used to help calm down the bladder and it works through the nervous system in the lower back to help calm the bladder down. 